to this week's G.I. Joe Toy Review, where we will be looking at Thundercracker. Or at least the G1 cartoon calls this one Thundercracker, the package calls it Skywarp. So I'm just going to go with G1 and call it Thundercracker. And, uh, this is Thundercracker, as you can see in his Thundercrackery mode, which he is nothing but a uh, Starscream repaint. You know, and of course, no wheels at the bottom. The wings, he's got his uh, no rays. But you can slide him if you want, like all planes should slide. You know, but before we get to finish looking at Thundercracker in robot mode, let's talk about our shout outs of the week. Um, back to the media at 48 South Loudon Street, where you get all your video game needs. So go ahead and check them out. Uh, you get the games all the way by, all the way back to the Atari, all the way up to the current systems, the PS3s, the Xbox 360s, all that stuff. Uh, so go ahead and check them out. And then go to 115 South Loudon Street to Time Traveler Toys and Collectibles. See Charles and Jack and check them out. And uh, actually, I got this, I got this figure and the other one, Thundercracker and Skywarp 2 pack. From Time Traveler about two weeks ago, three weeks ago, something like that. But, uh, you know, got them at Grapple and a couple G.I. Joe stuff from there just the other day. And, uh, I'm thankful for that. I'm glad they had this stuff in stock. But, uh, if you leave Time Travelers, go to 80 Wings Lane, the Four Color Fantasies. And get all your comic book needs. Marvel, DC, IDW, Image, all points in between. And uh, go ahead and check them out. And uh, you can also go to Robert C. Brown at Hailing Grace Counseling Services for all your counseling needs. So go ahead and check them out. Check him out. And he's good for all premarital, marital, you're just your rough, average, everyday. Life sucks and gloomy because it's raining outside like it is today here in Winchester. Kind of counseling. And uh, Dr. Robert C. Brown is good to listen to. So, check him out. So, let's get back to uh, Thundercracker. Thundercracker here. And you see where you see his upper body mode right there. I mean, this is a cool looking jet. So, it's Skywarp. But, uh,. Let's go ahead and change, look at him in robot mode. So here's, uh, here's Thundercracker in his robot mode. As you can tell, very, you know, very star screamy looking. And, uh, let's take a look at his articulation. He does have a lot of wiggly waggly and head movements. And he does have arm rotation his arm bend at the elbow his and does his swivel it does move to the tra uh, um, transformation but that's when you uh, actually open up the forearm piece his leg does go forward about that far and it can bend backwards about that far no, really, no foot pivots or anything. But this is Thundercracker. Very good looking figure. I really like the color scheme with the purples and the blacks with the silvers. And that little red, white, or purple and white on the strips. But this is a very good looking figure. I like this figure. He's very Thundercrackery. Uh. But this has been Thundercracker. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Tune in next week as I'm going Beast Wars again. And uh, with a maximum. I'm not going to tell you who it is. You have to tune in next week to see it. But uh, this has been Thundercracker. Tune in next week as we do continue Black History Month for G.I. Joe. But this has been Thundercracker. See y'all in the next one.